we play Huston baseball, we can play with anybody in the country. Um, and we certainly proved that here the past couple of years. Things are changing a little bit for Huston baseball. We're certainly excited about the future and you know what we've developed here. Over the weekend, the Eagles took a 5-2 win over Tufts University in the regional round, winning an NCAA tournament game in consecutive seasons for the first time in program history. It's certainly special. Um, obviously, it still stings, I think, with being um, how close we really were you know, to moving on and, and, and winning another game and, and getting into a regional final. Uh, but I think something, you know, as the weeks go on and it settles in, something you're certainly going to be proud of, you know, and proud of this group for that. After the victory, the Eagles went on to take the regional champ Wheaton College to 13 innings, with the game being decided by just a few inches. It's kind of luck in weird ways, you know. We would have won two games if, you know, ground ball is six inches to the left, you know, and that's kind of the, when baseball's, you know, great, it's great. When it's not, it's not. Now, reaching the regional round is something they've come to expect recently. Since 2019, They've competed in every NAC championship game, but that culture wasn't built overnight. Once it kind of started to happen and it started to click, now it's, you know, what our guys expect in that locker room and, uh, you know, something that won't really change here anytime soon with me being here. While Husson bids farewell to some very important seniors, they also boast a strong group of freshmen and sophomores. Freshman Hunter Curtis, NAC Rookie of the Year, and Keegan Sear, the tournament MVP as well as sophomore pitchers Connor Abood and Matt Wallingford, both first team all-conference. I think some of the older guys who have, who have been here now have been in a regional three times, and uh, um, now we have some younger guys who have got to experience that, and a lot of freshmen who played in some really big games here the last couple of weeks. Um, I think it just gives you confidence. And if you want to know what's next, it might be something you've heard before. Keep playing Husson baseball. Uh, we don't really try to do a lot of you know, different things. We're not going to change what we do. Uh, you know, we're just going to go out and, you know, maximize our time here. In Bangor, I'm Tyler Cruz, ABC7, Fox 22 Sports.